Okay, so I want to talk to you about pearling uh, with my freshwater tank. Uh, this is a 30 gallon fresh water of glowfish, some neon, some blue neons, and um, got some quarry cats. No, some auto cat, auto cats. And uh, what else? A yo yo loach, that's it. I want to talk to you about this pearling. I got, I never had this issue. I purchased uh, some Amazon swords. And I was kind of freaking out the other night. I did like a 30% water change um, as soon as I noticed it. Uh, cleaned up the substrate. And um, I was like, what are these bubbles coming in my tank? In the back, you can see like the air stone bubbles there, the air stone bubbles there. But let me show you something on top. Looks like I got soap in my tank. Sudsy. I freaked out. I was like, no, my poor fish. I didn't know what to do. I started hitting the forums. Going crazy. I mean, this is a hot mess. Freaked me out. Never had any issues with this tank. Tank's been running for a little over a year. No issues. So, started doing some research. And I started finding out about this pearling. Um, so I got these Amazon swords. See the little micro bubbles? They're coming from my Amazon swords, right here, and they're just floating up. But then the air stone is moving them, moving them around, pushing them up, and the agitation of the water is causing these little micro bubbles to come up top. And from my understanding, um, on the forum, some people say, "Oh, it could be excess minerals being released," and there's this pearling and for those that have freshwater tanks pearling is what you want people want to see pearling and I've never experienced this so very new to me but uh, this is what I got and it looks wild up top with the air stones if I stop the air stones if I turn them off then these, these suds will stop the bubbles will stop but I still got the micro bubbles you know, coming from the plants, which uh, I guess is an indication that they're they're very very healthy. So, um, just wanted to update my page, and uh, you know, for those that may come across this, it may not necessarily be a bad thing. Um, you know, make sure you're not using any dish detergent or or uh, any type of chemicals within your aquarium ever. But um, it's something I never do and I kind of freak. But uh, if you have any questions, comments, concerns, please leave them below. I will respond. And uh, talk to you guys later. Pearling. Look it up.